This is my dad, Kurt Mayer, and in 2008, he was diagnosed with clear cell renal carcinoma, a stage 3 cancer. On July 8, 2008, he underwent a complete right radical kidney nephrectomy, the removal of the whole right kidney. A year without complications went by, but on July 8, 2009, blemishes appeared on his x-ray scans. With a biopsy conducted, we knew two tumors had appeared on the left lungs, inner and outer walls. The renal cancer had metastasized in the lungs. He chose to do some intense treatment of interleukin-2 high-dosage biotherapy. On August 6, 2009, a PICC line was installed in the left arm where the treatment would be injected to avoid hardening of the arteries. Starting August 9, 2009, he was admitted to the USC Nora Center to begin the 14-dose treatment. The treatment trained white blood cells to attack the body and cancer cells. He had never experienced such intense feelings of unbearable itching, sunburnt skin, racing heartbeats, and incredibly weak blood pressure. On October 22, 2009, the cancer was found on his spinal column, having taken over the C3 and parts of the C2 and C4 vertebrae. Surgery was performed to remove most of it. With more complications, he was put into a halo to keep his head stable because the spine is now too weak to support his head. He was intubated several times and now uses a stomach feeding tube. Gladly, he is still with us today. However, the cancer still exists.